good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever, well, good night, whatever you are in the world, whatever time of day it is. This is Rachel, also known as Sitsy Diamond Painter, and um, I'm just doing a little whip because I've just done a couple of unboxings, and um, not unboxings of diamond paintings, of um, some accessories. That I want to try. So I am using. I've bought some Gorilla Tack. In my pen, so I've changed it over to the Diamond Art Club pen for this. Um, I'm just filling in the four placer with some. I normally just use um, heart wax. I don't know if it's any good with ABs, and I won't be trying that because there's no ABs in this painting. I'm, I'm sorry if I shake you and I'm wobbling you. Now, I did get a tray, but I'm not using that because I've got to work some stuff out with it. So, I am using my good old Add More Zest tray. And I might go with the grey one actually. The grey one is actually smaller. I've worked out. It's got more. I don't know if you can see that add more zest. The lighting's not great today. If I put that on, we can see. That's better. Add more zest. So, um, I am just, I'm working on. Mackenzie's Treasure from by Mandy Manzano for Diamond Art Club from Diamond Art Club and this is for the Mermaids and Magic 2022 I could do this event all year I've got enough I've got enough to do an event for all year for Mermaids and Magic um, what colour am I going to go? Let's have a look, let's have a look. We will go horrible. Um, where is it? Hey, put it in the wrong place. Oh no, there it is. So it's 5.50, the arrow up. You can't go wrong. You cannot go wrong. So this is um, the, the first of week, day of week two of the Mermaids and Magic event. Um, and it's been hosted by call Randy, who is Call Me Butter. You can call me Butter and Shay from Shay's Craft and Create. What a shape. I'll put the links in <laughs> um, if I remember. I'm no good with links. No good at all. So I'm using this Gorilla Tack. I'm a bit worried it's going to stick to the um, it's the only thing when you first start using a fresh it's very spongy the Gorilla Tack. And I'll use a hard wax normally, so that's going to take a bit of getting used to. It hasn't come out the pen yet, which is always a good sign. Um, I do multiply a lot anyway on this one. So yeah, the mermaids and magic. Oh, oh, there's so many diamond paintings I want now. If you go on Instagram and look on the hashtag oh. they are stunning 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 but I've been good and I haven't bought any I it helps I can't afford to buy any but that's <laughs> the point is it um And then 
oh there's just some stunning and some people are so quick i mean people say i'm quick but oh my life i will admit i do have cut off times i'm not one of these that you won't find me diamond painting at like till one o'clock in the morning You know, it. But, oh, I wish I could. I get really, I get really peeved off when I need to stop diamond painting, even if it is for sleep. Or just to chill out because my eyes are going blurry. Or Which reminds me, it's alright this tack so far. If I put my glasses. Oh, there they are. I've had, I've had a hormone of migraine all weekend. So, I'll keep my glasses on. So it don't come back. So it took me off my feet. Oh, well, I didn't get, I, I got up for about half eight on Saturday. But I had to take my silly self to bed about one o'clock because the only thing that I can do is go in a dark room and try and sleep. Painkillers and but sadly for me they're hormonal and there's nothing I can do to to stop it. You know, prevent it kind of thing. So. It's not nice. So, oh, I love doing that. Um, if you haven't watched it, um, I did a Would You Rather with um my th my second youngest so there's andrew nicholas michael and max and michael i did a would you rather on oh yeah we really we both really enjoyed it <laughs> i'm a bit concerned about michael's tendency to towards blackmailing people um and um it was just fun. I really enjoyed it. I love talking with the kids when it's just messing around and, you know, just enjoying each other's company. And it was really... So, yeah, I'm really... Lo Max Max has watched the video about... Or listened to it about three times and he really wants to do it. So, that's a good thing. So, yeah, Max on Friday. So, we're trying to find a... Um, Some more age related would you rather because I think the ones that Michael found <laughs> were just weird and they were a bit adult some of the questions they were things that nine year olds well he's nearly he's ten at the end of this month Max is um, yeah the ten, ten year olds shouldn't be thinking about really so uh, if you had to pull, you know, if you had to pull the plug or, yeah, there was all court sorts on there. It was, it was fun. So all them people that have done Would You Rather videos that are diamond painting. So, um, where did I, where did I see them that give me the inspiration for it? Um. Diamond Painting Claire did it with her daughter, um, Nurse Rachel. Now, she's new to me. I've not really seen any of her. Oh, she's got the most... Going off on a tangent. But she's got the most soothing voice. Um, I don't know why I've only just... subscribe to it. I don't know she's just never come up in my
Well, anyway, she she did she went on a nap, I think, and she was guessing the question: would, would you rather, and which one bag up the most votes and stuff like that. And then there was someone else that did a would you rather. So there was Diamond Painting Claire, Nurse Rachel. There was three. Mm -hmm. Who was it? I don't know. There was someone else. I should have wrote it down, shouldn't I? Oh, I don't know, but some of the questions are so strange, but it's so much fun. It is real fun. <laughs> and if it gets your kids to talk to you for a half an hour, then it's even more. Because, you know, Mikey's never been a talker anyway. And um, he's also a teenager. So I get answers in looks and grunts sometimes. If he can even acknowledge me enough to do that. Um, I just really liked it. I don't know a lot. Um, oh, they just make me laugh, kids. So that was fun. What else have I done this way? And like I said, Max is doing Friday. Is uh, it's today? Is what day is it today? Tuesday. The eighth is it? Yeah, it's the eighth today. Must be. Who knows? It's March anyway. Oh, I can't believe it's March. I can't believe my baby's going to be 10. Mikey's going to be 16 in September. Nicholas is going to be 18 in... Oh, excuse me. 18 in July. Um... Oh my god, Nicholas is going to be 18. And then Andrew will be 24 Christmas Day this year. So he's closer to 23 than 24. Mikey will be going into his... Um, last year of school in September. He'll be doing all his GCSEs next year. Then, um, excuse my belly, I don't know why it's growling so much. Um, Nicholas will be in his last year at college, probably. I don't know what we're going to do after that, to be quite honest. We're hoping he's going to get an apprenticeship or something with a company or something to do that's aware of special needs. We'll have to, I'm going to worry about that next school term, school year. Um, and Max will be in his last year of junior school. Oh no, my babies. And then Mark Andrew, well he's working full time, he's got his own place and he lives in Manchester and I'm in Brom, so. I don't speak to him often. Apparently it's a phase boys go through, I've been told. Who knows? But um, 
He's doing well, so that's what matters. There's something, but you know when there's some things and you think, oh, Andrew would love that. So it's a bit like, um, when I am, um, <laughs> when I split up from my ex-husband, um, I booked myself a little cruise down the River Nile, <laughs> like you do, to celebrate freedom. My mum and dad had the boys. Max wasn't around and Mr P wasn't around there. Well, he was actually after a... Because he looked after the cats while I was in Egypt. Um... And I booked myself um, a cruise down the River Nile. And um, I went all on my own. It was lovely. Oh, I loved it. I loved it. And, um, but when I, when I went to certain places, like so I went to Valley of the Kings and stuff, all I kept thinking was, oh, Andrew would love this. Andrew would love this. Because he, he likes history and stuff like that. He's, um... He can be quite intellectual when he wants to be. And, and I'm, I'm a bit like that now. There's some things I look at or I hear something or... And I think, oh, Andrew would love that. You know, if he was here, he'd, he'd appreciate the sense of humour of that. You know, something like that. So... There you go. I'm just going to check I'm doing the wrong one. Yeah. I've done that a couple of times, you know. I've. All you can see is my hand, is it? Is that better? See my lovely hand and my. Horrible nails. So, oh no, I haven't put my cover minder on. One second. So, the cover minder I'm using is, where is it? Of course, it's a. I don't know why it's got two magnets on it for. Oh, sugar. Oh. That was good. The magnet stuck to the metal on my desk. <laughs> I didn't go under anything. Um, oh, sh oh my life. I've got the right dropsies this morning. I'm blaming Claire. <laughs> She'd be a pretty, 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 pretty. Oh my life. I'm, I'm on a right one today. He's me thinking I'm all organised and got oh my, oh, oh, oh. where's that gone now? Oh, I threw, I've lost my magnets, oh there they are, I threw my drills everywhere yesterday, luckily I think I've got enough, right let's try again, shall we? there we go well done me I think I've switched my light pad off just because you can see it better and that oh I'm moving oh my right you get a silly grip on your silly self so I forgot where I was now, because oh, how traumatic was that? What was I saying? Oh, 
<sighs> what was I talking about? Oh, I hate that. Oh, I've got a brain like a sieve. It retains nothing. I think it's because it has to retain important stuff. Sorry. <laughs> Just forget to the rest. I was going to say, Mr. P knows how to do the wobble. Says there's a wobble thing so it doesn't look like your, your camera's wobbling. Because I got one of them arm things, these stretchy, windy arm things. And I really like what it can I can do with it, but I don't know. I'll have to work it out. I really forgot what I was going to talk about. I know I mentioned my trip down the river Nile. I was on about the kids. Oh, who knows? Who knows? So has anyone done anything interesting this week? Have they bought anything nice from Diamond Art Club or from anywhere else? Oh, craftably I've got some beautiful paintings on there. Mm -mm -mm. But even, it's just, the shipping is just so expensive. It can sometimes work out more than the painting. So I'm not going to be getting for oh and then oh, what else did I do? Oh and then Diamond Art Club bought out oh, the wizard Medusa. Medusa I wanted um I wanted the wizard and I wanted the, there was like a lady in red, pink maybe, she was really pretty, but it was the wizard, because I really want, you know the wizard with the dragon, and they're, oh that's stunning, my kid loved that as well because he loves Harry Potter and stuff like that, how's this, this putty going, it's alright, it's I think it's because I'm not used to um, oh, I'm, I, I use a hard wax so once it's in there it don't move that much and it's always a pain with the multi places I think until you've got the um, wax settled in a bit It's great once it has. I just have to say as well, after working on, because I haven't worked on a a diamond art club in a bit. It's been a it's been a blink. And um oh it's like coming home. There's nothing like it. I don't know what it is with the but you just can't beat it. Doesn't matter how good the other companies are. <laughs> when you start working on a diamond art club, I mean, there's some people that hate diamond art. I do. That's personal preference, isn't it? I suppose. But for me, I think if I could only choose one, it would have to be diamond art club. Oh, and then Dreamer Designs have got some lovely ones as well. The Fairy with the Lion. There's a unicorn field thing going on. And... Mm -mm -mm. I do like the artwork from DIY Moon Shop. But I am so disappointed with my last one I did. Well, it was my first one I've done that I just can't warrant. Even if I had the money, I don't think I'd buy from there. Um, I just, yeah. 
So I do want to buy an hour lower, an hour lower than the, the, the one, but I'm a, I do prefer square drills. And nearly every hour lower one I've seen so far. Um. How can I put it? They've not been great, have they, really? There's been issues with popping drills and... So I think I'm going to... Well, I've got no choice. I've got to wait a bit anyway. I'm on a newborn. No ones. Um... Um, so yeah, oh, there's so many I want to get from Diamond Painting Deutschland, it's unreal. Of the Josephine wall, I want to buy some that aren't Josephine walls and like one that's poured glue to see what their other kits are like. But again, I'm on a no boy, so that's not happening. I want to do a heaven and earth design. Because that looks just for I don't want to do a blank canvas. <laughs> that's not the way I roll. Is that that that's too much like hard work for me. Um but I would like to do one where you buy all the drills and I'd like to get ever moment drills, I think, if I was to do that. Can you buy ever moment drills? Does anybody know if you can buy ever moment drills? Let me just have a swig of this cold tea. Like cold tea, I drink cold tea quite often because I forget it's there. Um, what else? Heaven and Earth design. However, I'm going to do this year somewhere within the mix. If you watch my first stash video, I've actually got um, Diamond Art Club, a canvas with no drills. Because I had the wrong canvas. The canvas was wrong when I opened it. Um, but I've got loads of Diamond Art Club spares. So I'm going to... Um, it'll probably be... Um, I don't know. <laughs> it will be this year. That's one thing I'm going to do this year, definitely. I am trying to follow at least one event... A month um, but because I don't normally do events I don't want to try and join loads all at the same time or anything like that so I'm doing this event with them um, for mermaids and magic 2022 and it's beautiful There's, it is beautiful Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, but then, um, Emeralds and Fairy Lights, Lin Lindsay, she's doing um, green, anything green or fairy. So I might do one of them. But I don't know if you can start a week late. Do you know what? Do you, do you have to be on the first? So if anybody's watching and has got this fire in my video of rambling about nothing, do you know if you can start for Emeralds and Fairy Lights event mid-month? Well, it's only the eighth day because I've got a canvas I want to do, but then it's massive. Uh, so I don't know if it's going to be finished by the end of the month. But it's, I need, I want to do it, so I'll just do it anyway and see if I can get it done in, I don't think I'll get it done in three weeks, but I might do. It's a round and it's a craftably and it's an older kit. Because I'm determined to get, do more older kits this year rather than the ones that are newer. 
And then I don't know what months are going I don't know. So they're, they're my two if I can do that this week. I haven't got any DPs with sparklers. I haven't. Is it team? I haven't got any, so I can't join that one. Um, there's someone doing something else, and I can't think what it is. There's a few, isn't there? There's a Josephine wall along one. Um, I don't multi whip, so that takes out. I have to choose. Um, what I'm going to do and I just finished Unicorn Kiss so I didn't want to do a Josephine one because I could have done that for <sighs> for Mag Mermaids and Magic as well but um And this has been, yeah, I just didn't fancy doing another Josephine wall so soon after doing that huge, that big one, which I love doing, but you'd, I think if I was to do it consistently, it would, it would take the joy out of it. So, so yeah, what else? I've still got another stash video I could do, but I don't know if I'm going to bother doing it. It's all like my eBay ones. You know, like the 30 by 40, but are actually... 25 by 34 kind of thing. And that, I mean, that's a good thing as well about um, YouTube. There's so many different diamond painting channels. I really like that because some some channels won't suit some people and I know that some people won't like my accent and some people love it, some people hate it. Um, they won't mind they like the fact that I'm all over the place like I did the rim wreck. There's more, I don't know. There's more choice out there now. Definitely more choice. I think that's really good. I love this pink. It looks so good in that grey tray as well, don't it? These are... Um, this is a kit from 2019. So I think they've changed the drills about three times. <laughs> it's got no IBs in it because there was no such things as IBs when um, I bought this kit. Um, you could add IBs, but they haven't re-rendered it to have IBs. I did look on the site, um, well, I looked on the app, and uh, yeah, there is no IBs in this, even the one that you buy um, now. But I still think it's worth it. A lot of people that are really into IBs bling up the self anyway. I did think about blinging it up. But I'm just not. I'd have to buy. I have got some square rhinestones. I did buy some quite square rhinestones off AliExpress. Um, but um, I'm 
I never place my drills properly. So I don't know what the newer kits drills are or anything, but this is lovely. I saw Rachel Ray do an unboxing of this. I thought like, I have to have it. And even on an older kit. Oh, it's just, there's nothing wrong with it. There really isn't. I mean, if you think this kit's, what, nearly three years old? The glue's good on it. Nothing's faded or... But you're so pretty. So after I've um, done this colour, then um, I'll show you. I'm wondering if I can fit all of these. I'm just trying to think what I can talk about just to finish this section off if you hear the dog I don't know what the dog's growling at the dog the dog's scared of its own farts to be quite honest so when he growls and barks at the door when there's no one there I'm trying to think what else I've done I've got the dog a new bed well, not a new bed, but new, like, cushioning for it. Because he has a, he has a hard plastic bed and then, um, he's, had, he's come in because he's heard me talking about him. He's gone back out. Um, he, um, we buy like these cushing things, but they don't wash well. They're very cheap, but they don't wash well. Um, so we ended up going to where we get them from. And they'd got none left. But we really needed to get a new one. It's one where all the padding just kind of goes clumpy. In. So, but it's probably cheaper to buy one than it is to keep washing it, so... They were that cheap. I don't think they will be now. Nothing's cheap now. So, but they've got like these big, massive, like fur, pink fur beds. I mean, they were flimsy, but if you're putting it inside the, a hard bed, it would just be like just cushions and cushions of cushioning. And it, it's great. <laughs> So his um he's now got a bright pink bed, fluffy bed. The kids Max keeps lying in it because he thinks it's so comfy. He wants to know because my Max makes nests everywhere he goes. Max makes nests. He um. He loves cocooning himself and wrapping himself in pillows and blankets and teddies and snugglies. He'll have a snuggly on and then a blanket wrap round him and he'll have all his teddies and bean bags underneath him and when you when you go and um go in to check on him on the night, you can't find him. Because he's eating amongst the everything. So, 
What time are we on? I don't know. I can't see. 40 minutes. That's not too bad. So what else have I been doing? Nothing much. Diamond painting, of course, when I can. Like I said, it, when I've got... Oh, I have hormone and migraines, and once they hit me, I can't function. Well, I do for a little bit, and then... I have to take my silly self off to bed. And just lie in the dark. There's... There's nothing I can do about it. Some months are worse than others. But it was a right doozy this weekend. So I didn't diamond paint at all. And then I, and then I feel worse because I... Because I want to diamond paint, but I can't diamond paint. Luckily, I'd done most of the washing in that Friday. So that wasn't too bad. Pinks, plates, every rainbow colour you can think of is in this. Red and yellow and pink and green, purple and orange and blue. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow tune. See? Every colour of the rainbow. I never understood that song. Well, I loved it when I was little, but then that's not the order the colours of the rainbow go, so. Why did they do it? I don't even know where that song's from. I used to sing it all the time when we were kids. Every time a rainbow come out, red and yellow and pink and green. I haven't thought of that song in a while. But there is every colour. Every single colour with a rainbow. Trying to think what else, what else, what else. I've got Nicholas's parents evening tonight. Online. It's due a review actually, so that needs to get sorted at some stage. Mr P's got a course tomorrow. So he's not um, an happy chapper. Because where um, he works for um, a council, and we're it's the council that are dealing with the Commonwealth Games. So we're in Birmingham, and. Um, He's having to do a training course, but apparently they're going, they're learning. I'll be, I'll be honest, you know, some of the places where he has where he has to go and work. I mean, he normally works in um, a cemetery, maintaining the grounds on a, in a cemetery. Um, so he doesn't really deal with. Um, people that often, um, but in the winter he has to work all over the place, and there's some good old rough old 
estates he has to work on. And they're learning them some self-defence moves, apparently. He's found out. Now, he thought it was to do with, because of the... Well, I thought it was to do with, because of the Commonwealth, it's to deal with the public. Because there's going to be a lot more. And then, obviously, like, um, there's Commonwealth memorials and things in cemeteries and stuff, so they might get a few people in there to look at. But who knows? But there, But there's all things about... Learning self-defence moves and that. So he was stressed about that. Because they call people up in the front. And he's got excited. He's going, I'm telling them I'm not doing it. Don't tell them then. So that's tomorrow. Parents' evening. I will have to go shopping at some stage today. I will have to um, I'm trying to get this done but then I've noticed another bit so what I might do because you don't want to see what I've done so far with a big a little gap there do you I'm trying to think what else I've got to do today, this week. Is there any more appointments this week? Uh, no. I can't think of any. There's, but there's bound to be something, but... Um, nothing that I can remember at the minute anyway. Um, as usual, I'll have to go shopping and... It was freezing this morning. I was I was actually getting excited, think I can start hanging my washing out to save on the electric bills because oh my crikey. Yeah, something's gotta give somewhere, hasn't it, really? Um, on that point. I mean, there was so it would have saved on my tumble dryer. We've we've tried we've tried saying to the kid, you know. Just because it's touched your skin when you've carried it upstairs clean doesn't mean you've got to put it back in the wash can. Because <laughs> I just things that I've never even seen them wear get in the wash. Or he did. I mean, I know, you know, Max is only 10, so he's like the smallest. But Nicholas and obviously Mr. Mister P has his work clothes and then whatever, casual But I, how does he? I just don't get where it all comes from. I really, really don't. So this will be a good test for this putter. I'm a dipper. For those that don't know what I think is a dipper. This is a dipper. Let me think. Ba -ba -ba. There's only two number twos. This is how I threw all my drills everywhere yesterday, dipping. And then. There he is. Oh, I've just gone fishing and then I've ended up with that many on the end. <laughs> yeah, maybe not dipping. Oh, no, they're all stuck on there now. Maybe not for dipping then. 
it's too much access on the pen I think that's what it is and if I get the I just need to find one will it stick to oh yes oh no I lost it see sometimes it actually takes longer to dip than it does just to um there's one there as well It takes longer to dip than it does just to pour me in the trap. Oh my life. Oh, there's some lovely um shimmering canvases and stuff. Oh, have you seen some of their stuff? I saw on one fun diamond pack. No, was it one fun diamond pack? No. I don't know it wasn't. But there was, oh, a unicorn one in crystals. And that was amazing. I can't even remember what it said. But I don't know if they delivered to the UK anyway. Because it was an American company. That's what I was checking. There was an, a delivery come in. So yeah, I don't think I'm going out anywhere bar shopping. My world is um, cooking and diamond painting and cleaning, which I quite like, you know. Kids. So I'm trying to think of as well because I'd like to start doing a regular thing with the kids. So should I just stick with doing different variants of would you rather or can anybody think of any more word games I can play? with the boys um just to entertain because it's nice to how can i put it the boys don't the boys like doing their own thing a bit like me they're, they're not doing their own thing the dad's the same um or mr p's the same um we're all quite comfortable doing what we want to do and I think I'd like them to be more involved you know find things to do and they really well Mikey really enjoyed it on um Friday Max is really excited about it from my Max is the one that does he, he wants to do things with you, so he does things with his dad on the weekends, like fix his computers, and they go and play football. They've played football in the park, and Mikey and Max do more with Mr. P than they do with me. And it's trying to find some common ground, you know, and if that's what it takes is a you them to go on YouTube so they can... Take the pee out of mum then. And have a bit of fun. We are definitely a family that don't get offended. Well, Nicholas gets really offended, but he's he's autistic. <laughs> he has autism, so. It's to be expected. And then teenagers tend to have, be touchy anyway. Who knew that Kevin and Perry? I don't know if you've ever seen Kevin and Perry. Who knew? Who knew that that is is literally what happens? <laughs> Sometimes Mr. P was going, "Oh, Max is going to change it to a teenager." So yeah, I'm nearly finished. I've nearly finished. If I can get it done within the hour, I'll be very happy with that. And I knew, knew I could, well, I'd, I obviously waffle on about absolute nothing all the time. 
So I want, I want to get this section done. Because then I start the mermaid then, you'll see in a bit. I love this blue. It's like a baby blue. Oh, I was watching um, Suzanne from um, Stone Magpie do a kitten up video. And um, she'd got a list of a name of all the colours that she was de kitting. And we, she, <laughs> she was making me laugh. Because she was guessing the colours. <laughs> And then, um, I guessed one right, which was Dusty Pink, just Dusty Rose. And that's the only one I would guess right. And she was going, no, I don't agree with that. <laughs> so that's really fun, because I did notice on face, face, was it on Facebook? Um, Diamond Art Club had put a list of all the names of the colours and stuff, and the... The AB, I think there was AB conversions on there as well. And I was thinking, oh, I've got to print that off. And then, I, and it was so funny watching Suzanne um, from Stone Magpie trying to work out what the colours was going to be. Really enjoyed myself. I am going back through, I go through phases of where <coughs> all I want to do is watch other channels. And what I don't, I'm not, I don't like to watch unboxing still because I get really upset that I can't buy them. Um, but I like watching the review, you know, the, the final reviews and stuff like that. And then weeps. I'm not, lives are alright, but I don't like going on lives where there's like 50 people in the chat. I prefer the um, smaller lot. And I tend to find. That on the lives, they're never at the right time. Well, I always think, oh, I wish I'd do that in the morning. <coughs> but, um, yeah, I just don't seem to hit the right times. And then they'll be late on the night, you know, they'll be like 11 o'clock at night. I need to be in bed by 11 o'clock. And I, I'm not keen on watching reruns of lives. Is anyone else the same or is it just me being a finicky? Finicky, finicky, finickety. Um, yeah, I've nearly finished, people. I've nearly finished. Nearly finished this section. As you can see, I'm not one for needing the drills to be perfectly in or anything like that. I just whack them in. I'm not. I'm. I'm not worried about gapping or <laughs> popping. I, mm, that is my one pet peeve: popping pop, drills. So if you roll a rim and they're still popping, there's an issue. But I've never had an issue with Don Mark Club, to be honest. So if I pause you, and I'm back, and I just saw. So I've done. I started. Here, so I did this this corner. So if I zoom you out a bit, that's a bit better. It's going to be so. I started here, did all the outside of the unicorn, worked my way around to do this bottom bit, and there. Worked my way up. Can you see the sparkle, people? And then worked my way around. So then I've done. I'm zooming you out a bit. That's a bit better, isn't it? So I've done this. You've just watched me finish this bit here. And. Just got this bit of body on the unicorn, and then that. So I might finish it today. Might, might finish her today. Oh sugar! 
And there we go. My cold cup of tea. So yeah, it's beautiful. The colours are stunning. Absolutely stunning. You can't really tell at the minute because the sun's at the back of the house. And even though it is quite sunny, it's freezing. And um, I haven't got the light on. That's it. That's uh, my setup. That's for this here. Is what I've started to collect all my drills I don't keep to take to the school and that's my setup for Ta -da! there you go so that's me done for today I'm going to love you and leave you and I hope to speak to you soon bye